will be using the induction, just like we do it on this stage. Okay. All great. right. Are you ready? Ready. Now, ladies and gentlemen, we come to a phase in our program tonight in which we're going to deal with the phenomena of hypnosis. Now, hypnosis takes us into a condition of mind that, on the surface, very much resembles going to sleep. You become relaxed, your eyes become heavy, you become drowsy, and you become, you might say, actually sort of sleepy. But hypnosis must be looked upon as sort of like a dream state. And you know how dreams are. Dreams come out of your unconscious. And some dreams are very vivid. You remember them. Other dreams, they just disappear and vanish. You'll find your experience of being hypnotized is very much like entering a state of dreams. And so, look upon hypnosis in this regard. When you go to sleep at night, you lie down and diffuse your attention. When you enter hypnosis, you concentrate your attention upon a point, and that point brings your focus of attention down so fine and so powerful that you enter a condition of mind that is called hypnosis or is regarded as hypnotism. Now, for our purpose of our object of concentration tonight, I am going to use a candle flame. Now, candles, as you know, are used a great deal in religious rituals, rituals of all kinds. And the reason seems to be that a candle is symbol of, symbolism of a transformation of one form of energy in the universe to another type. First of all, we have material matter. Then we have fire. And the fire changes the material into a gas. And the gas rises up into the cosmos, into the heavens. And that's why a candle is so effective as you concentrate upon it let it take you with it up, up, up to the higher levels of spiritual being. And so if we're all ready now, let's enter the phenomena of hypnosis. Now where you're going to go, that's entirely up to you. You may go down to the very depths of the inner abyss and not remember a thing. On the other hand, you may just stay where you are. But if you want to really experience something wonderful, let yourself drop inside yourself to the inner depths of your inner being. Because in that inner being, there's complete blissfulness, serenity, and peace. All the conflicts and all the stress of the world are gone and vanished. And that I promise you tonight. I'm going to give to you the peace that lies inside yourself. Do you like this? Excellent. This is all being at blim for you right now. Yeah, oh, you that's know. great. Great. <laughs> I just, it just kind of popped in. It might be good for you. Oh, yeah. Keep uh, going. All right. We'll keep going. All right, everyone. Now, first of all, I'm going to ask you to sit back in your chairs in a comfortable position so you will not have to move overly. Uh, rest your feet on the floor, please, and place your hands upon your lap so your fingers and uh, your hands do not touch or overlap. And now, direct your attention towards the flame of the candle, which is here before you. And as you think of it, let that occupy your attention completely. Now, all together with me, do this. I'm going to count from one to three. The count of three, take a deep breath and hold the breath inside your lungs. Are you ready? One, two, three, inhale. Hold the breath, hold the breath, and now exhale slowly, slowly, slowly. Let it out, relax, let every tension leave your body completely. How good you feel, and your eyes are getting fixed upon that candle flame. It occupies your attention completely in every way. And now, for the second time, all together with me, we'll take a deep breath. One, two, three, inhale the breath. Hold it, hold it, hold it, and exhale slowly. Let everything go. Your eyes, as you stare at the candle, are getting very tired and very, very heavy. They want to close, but do not do not close them yet. Keep staring at the candle flame for a moment longer, because one more time, another deep breath. One, two, three. Inhale deep, hold it, let it go, and relax. And now I'm going to count from 1 to 10 slowly. With every count, your eyes will get heavier and heavier. Let them close down together any time they wish, shutting out the light. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Let everything go. Eyes closing down. 6, 7. Eyes closing. 
Feels so good to close those tired, heavy eyes. Eight, nine, ten. Eyes closed. Breathe deep and free. What's that noise? Next door again. And every breath you take sends you down deeper and deeper into the realm of sleep. Remember, Tom, I said realm of sleep. Not sleep, to the realm of sleep. That's very subtle. What ex Explain what the difference is. The, what the difference is? The realm of sleep is everything that encompasses wherever the mind goes and is still not asleep. It's in a realm associated with sleep, but it is not unconscious. Okay. And yet, you still get the power of the suggestion of sleep. Because all the old masters love that one word, sleep. Right. You do it now on in an induction. Boom, sleep. Because sleep, the mind picks up very quickly because it's familiar with the experience of going to sleep. Anyhow, to get back on our routine.